As you know, Tally provides so many alternative schemes to facilitate and speed up data entry work. Today we are going to learn voucher entry in Contra Voucher. Contra Voucher is a special voucher which is used to move funds within the company or business. The possible four Contra entry in accounting are cash deposited in bank, cash withdrawn from bank, fund transferred to one bank account to another, cash transferred from one cash account to another. All these mentioned transactions are just a replacing of fund from one location to another. These kind of transactions have no effect in business results, I mean profit or loss. So we are going to enter some contra voucher as shown in the screen. We are going to enter these four transactions. To do this, go to accounting voucher. Now we are in accounting voucher creation screen in payment voucher. Press F4 or click contra button to access contra voucher. The current voucher is in double entry mode. We are changing it to single entry mode by pressing F12. And ok, use single entry mode for payment receipt contra, make this to yes. And save the screen. So we are in single entry mode. So let's enter the first entry. Cash deposited in SBI account number 651 rupees 1 lakh. Change the date if required. The journal for the transaction is SBI account letter to cash as the bank balance increases and uh, cash balance decreases. So enter the debit here for number 651. In contra which are single entry mode, always enter debit just after account. This should be debit always. Now the credit aspect which is cash and the amount here that is one lakh and the ratio. Now save the screen. Now we are going to end up the second one. Cash withdrawn from SBI account number 651 rupees to 25,000. The journal for the entry is cash account letter to SBI account as the cash balance increases and bank balance decre decreases. the date. Now the debit should be here and be credit as be amount 25,000 then narration and save the screen. Now we are going to enter the rest 2 in double entry mode. Double entry mode is useful while entering compound entry. In our ex example, third one is a compound entry. Cash transferred from SBI account number 651 to Access Bank, account number 451 and IOB account number 851, rupees 25,000 each. So we are transferring money from SBI account to IOB and uh, Access Bank account. The compound journal entry for the transaction is Axis Bank account data, IOP Bank account data to SBI Bank account. That is uh, because the balance of Axis Bank and IOP Bank increases by rupees 25,000 each, and the balance of SBI account uh, decreases by 50,000 rupees. So we are going to change in double entry mode by pressing after 
Now locate your single entry mode for payment receipt contra make this to know. Take the screen. Now we are in double entry mode. So just after two, which is the symbol of credit. Here we are crediting SBI P50,000 and by IOB Bank increases by 25 plus 25,000 you gain Axis Bank increases by 25,000 now let it here type narration and finally save the screen finally the last transaction cash given for petty cashier so here cash moving from main cashier to petty cashier so the journal will be uh, petty cash account data to cash cash means main cash account Petty cash account increases and main cash account decreases. So, predict main cash account by 15,000 and debiting petty cash account 15,000 and dash. If you hope this tutorial is helpful, thank you for watching.